right, so I'm gonna do a tutorial on dry brushing. So this is my preferred type of dry brush. It's just an old, worn out, beat up brush. I also use these, same type, but a little bit different sizes. Um, there's also brushes that you can get that are specifically made for dry brushing. Um, but I'm gonna show you on this bronze dragon. I did a live of me starting this, but no one was interested in the live. <laughs> so this is how he turned out before the highlights. So I'm going to take this color, Ironock Skin by Citadel. And I'm going to load up my brush, as you can see over here. And then I'm gonna take all this nice wet paint and just wipe it off. Wipe it, wipe it, wipe it. And you wanna get it to do like that. So it's barely anything coming out there at the end. And then I'm just gonna take this and I'm gonna lightly brush over everything that I want highlighted. So I want the wings to be highlighted so you can see as it's happening there from here to there. And you don't wanna do too much of this cause you can very easily overdo it and then it just looks like, like really thick paint. Like right there, I just got a little too much. So I'm gonna wet a brush and just try to get rid of it before it dries. It was already pretty dry there, but I think we got it and I'm just gonna wipe it off. Make sure I get all this out. Highlight. Got a little too much there as well. Let's rub that. So you want to keep a wet brush nearby just, <clears throat> just in case you're getting a little too much highlighting action going on. So I'm going to highlight these spines quite a bit, I think. I'm just gonna highlight the whole thing, I think. I don't know, do I like that? There's this side, and then that side. I guess it's all right. I can go back over it later with some, ooh, that might be nice, actually. I'm gonna do some silver. So Rune Fang Steel, I think I'm gonna do that as a highlight instead of this, um, Iron Rock skin. So let me get a little bit of this out. And you want to make sure that your brush is dry. And if you get all the color out of it, you can go ahead and use that for a different color like I'm doing here. I'm just rubbing it. And then I'm just going to dip it in my, my silvery color. Dab it. Get it down to a nice amount. And then we're gonna use this to highlight. There we go, I like that a lot more. And then you just brush over everything you want highlighted. You wanna to try to stick to the parts that would be getting hit by like light or the sun. And I know I'm kinda of going crazy and doing everything, but I kinda of do that. Dry brushing is like my favorite part of painting. I love to dry brush. It just adds such a cool effect. So I'm gonna get these spines really good because I want those to kind of be prominent. And getting right here in between the two wings is super hard to do for me. Get a little bit 
bit more silver on here. Give it a good dab. I hope you guys can see what I'm doing here. You just kind of like, I like to use the edge of the brush, not the tip, but the edge, and just kind of brush over really lightly. You don't want to put much pressure with this at all. And then when you get your desired effect, try not to hit that area again. And then I want to add a little bit to the tips and the claws. You know me, overdoing it. But yeah, basically this is dry brushing and this is my little tutorial for you guys. I'm not even gonna, I guess I should bother with it. I was gonna say I wasn't even gonna bother with the inside wings, but I'll just do a light dry brushing there too. So I think we're done. Final product. All right, hope you guys like the video. Thanks for watching.